In today's video, we're going to make quick disconnects for our Camelbacks, Antidotes, and the military version uh, with our Sawyer Mini water filters. So we have these connected more permanently, just connecting them via the tubes uh, like so, but it's kind of a pain because if you have good water that you're using and you don't necessarily need to, to filter them, then after every use, you know, you need to uh, maintain your mini sawyers and flush them out, put some uh, chlorine water in them, make sure they don't uh, get any mold or any, any bacteria in them themselves. So what we want to do is only use the mini sawyer when we have dirty water or water that needs filtration and then that allows us to use the camelbacks all the time with our, our fresh water and no need to uh, maintain the mini sawyers all the time. So what we're going to do today is we're going to modify these so they, they can be disconnected really quick and connected really quick. And uh, we'll show you how to do it. First up, we'll do the antidote. Uh, this is a really good bladder, especially for kids because it's easy for them to operate. It's easy for them to open and to, and to close as opposed to the military version. It also is very easy to push uh, quick disconnects. Uh, so when you get your antidote, it will come with the bladder and it will come with the tube. The tube will have this connected to the end of the tube. And what I did to permanently mount these, I just cut the tube, put one end on this side and one end on this side. But today, we're going to make it a quick disconnect. So in order to do that, you're going to need to get a conversion kit. And this you can get on Amazon Line or any sporting goods store, a lot of them. It's called Quick Link Conversion Kit for Camelback. So when you open up the kit, it's going to have two pieces. It's going to have the smaller piece, which is just like this one that we cut off the original tube. And then it's going to have the female piece, which is the same piece which is inside the bladder right here. And so what we're going to do is we're going to stick the quick link male piece back on the tube. And then we're going to stick the female piece on the end of the Sawyer Mini that has the little cap on it and the side that the arrow is pointing on. Okay, and to do that I'm just going to cut off a piece of this tube just a little bit and then uh, we'll connect it. Okay, what I've done is I cut off a little piece of the tube and that's just enough to connect it to the Sawyer as you can see and we'll connect it right now. Stick this end on the Sawyer Mini. If you're doing this for the first time, you might have to uh, wet the end of the Sawyer Mini because the, the tube's going to be very tight. <clears throat> we'll stick the female end on it like so. So at the bottom of the arrow where it says flow, we have the male end with the little piece of tube. And then where the point of the arrow is where the cap is on the mini we have the female piece okay and that's going to stay as one simple piece that we can connect and quick disconnect into our bladder and then on the tube we're just going to stick that male piece back on as it originally came in in the kit and so then you can use this normal every day when you have good clean water or you take it from your house and you go on a camping trip or a hiking trip or the zombie apocalypse comes and you have a full bladder of water you're good to go and then when you come across a stream or a river or whatever you can plug in your Sawyer Mini like so stick it in your bag and now it's automatic filtration on the go for the military Omega bladders, we're going to need a kit called the HydroLink Filter Adapter from Camelback. And this is important because it's different from the Antidote. The HydroLink goes to the Omegas and the QuickLink goes to the Antidotes. So this has all the pieces that you'll need to fit the uh, Sawyer Mini onto your Camelback. Uh, with one exception that if you don't want this female attachment 
on your Sawyer Mini that has the on off button and you want your original Hydrolink female adapter that goes on your tube, you'll need to get the squad back QL conversion kit and you'll need to cut the uh, female portion off of the tube. The male portion does not work with the Hydrolink so you're just basically buying this so you can get the female attachment. And that's what I want to do because I don't want the, uh, the extra complication of the on and off switch. So I bought this as well so I can use this as the female attachment and then use the male attachment which comes with the Hydrolink kit. And so we'll get to working on this. Be cutting off the tube off of this female piece and then attaching it to the Sawyer Mini. So I've cut the female portion, female adapter portion out of the squad back QL conversion kit. So just cut it off the tube and then I've inserted it on another small tube that I've put on the bottom of the Sawyer Mini. And so that connects to the male portion on your bladder. And then I'll take the male piece connector out of the Hydrolink adapter kit and attach it to another tube that I've connected to the top portion of the Sawyer Mini. So as the arrow flows, male portion up here, female adapter down here, and then now my tube is ready to connect to the top. And so there you have it. Now we have the ability to use our Camelback without the filter during normal operation and then uh, when things get bad or we're in the back country we can put on the Sawyer Mini to filter right out of the Camelback. And that's how we do the connections for the military version of the Camelback.